Hello, today we're running our uh, new steel, it's a prototype. So the steel is supposed to separate everything in one go. It's a continuous steel, uh, but it's not just stripping steel. So we're running mesh, and uh, here we've got our ethanol. Here in the bucket we've got uh, stripped mesh. Here are our water and tails and some remaining spirit that can be redistilled again, no problems. And here's the heads. So this is the steel. It's got two columns. One column processes mesh and supplies crude ethanol into another column. A lot of tubes, sorry. Here. Here we've got water separation and tail separation. Goes here. Here we've got some temperature control. We don't need it, but just reading some data, checking. Here we've got reflux ratio well. If you need to increase reflux ratio, is a well. Here we've got our ethanol running through this heat exchanger, and on top we've got another heat exchanger. And we've got our uh, head. This steel designed specially to process wines to make brandy, uh, brandy ethanol for brandy. So currently we're running some sugar, sugar-based wash, just to check it, test it see the percentage and everything um, and we're gonna run some wine for it as well red wine and gonna check and see what we what we've got from it now we've got a little bit of wine to distill it's a red wine 13 percent gonna make some brandy ethanol for brandy so now we're processing wine, you can see all tubes are red, wine going through the system. Here we've got our ethanol. It's a wine based ethanol, so the same one that used for bridges and cognacs. Again, here we've got our heads. Here we've got our heads. Separated. Stairs. And some. Water plus bit of ethanol. Just add it back to the main batch and it will be redistilled along with everything. Uh, main portion of tails, main portion of tails actually get reduced along with uh, empty mesh. It's a stripped one, and we still got a little bit here. So if you redistill it again, it will be right here in the bucket.
sorry for miss. So we purchased about, uh, not about, just 5 liters of wine and we've got almost 500 milliliters of ethanol and wine was around 11%, 11, 12, so about right. This is it, thank you.